What is up everybody, I am Ryan here, back with another video and in this video we're gonna use the pH paper on different kind of solutions. So let's get started. After all I've said, please don't forget, all my friends are heating, taking slow. You must know are like 1 to 7 is like before 7, like 1 to 6 is the acidic solution and after 8 14 is the basic solution so if we get these colors like before 7 the solution is gonna be acidic and if we get after 7 like 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 the solution is gonna be basic and if it's like near 7 and 8 the solution is gonna be neutral so let's so get here started I have the basic stuff you know it's vinegar hair cream oil water and soy sauce so we're gonna you know see everything with the pH paper you might know that vinegar is weak acid so maybe this will turn like into a red or orange stuff so I'll put the pH paper right in and it turned into an orange color now if we you know related to the book given to us the color is like near 3 so it means that it's like you know a weak acid or something the strongest it is like one so yeah we'll put this here down the vinegar like the orange stuff after that we'll take another ph paper the original color of ph paper is like this orange stuff <clears throat> now we're gonna put this in the hair cream now here it goes now you know it's all like all covered in hair and cream so you know i gotta clean it up I, I think with my hands so the color isn't changed I don't know why maybe because you know the solution is like not so hygroscopic I don't know well the color hasn't changed we'll put that here all right now I'll take another piece of paper now we have oil here and it's an unsaturated oil so we're gonna see how the color changes so the color changed like into dark yellow or maybe brown so we're gonna see what does brown what's brown here so brown hair is like you know um it's like the four number i didn't know oh yeah it contains fatty acid so it's gonna be an acid probably so yeah oil comes into like the acidic category so we're gonna go with the water now we all know water is neutral so the color will be like near seven and stuff so yeah let's check it out with the water so here we go with the water and as I told you it's gonna be you know like green and stuff so we're gonna wait for it to turn green like it takes a little time not too much but yeah as you can see here now it's turned into like you know the neutral kind of stuff like near seven so we know that water is neutral so yeah we proved that water is neutral so i'm gonna put it here now we can do it with the soy sauce soy sauce is black so maybe the paper might turn black too so here we go with the soy sauce where's the soy sauce no it didn't turn black it's actually you know turning into color so this color is like you know acidic yeah wait a second yeah here we go now you know this color is like 3 or 4 or something, so that's into the acidic category. So yeah, we did like 6 tests here. The first one was vinegar, which was, you know, turned into a reddish color. Here it is. I'm gonna focus it up. So here we go with the reddish color. After that hair cream, you know, it is actually turning into like, you know, a green color right now. So maybe it's neutral or maybe like it comes into the basic category like 8 or 9. Is it turned green and it's sticked to it. Now oil also turned into, you know, the acidic category. Like the 3 or 4, so it's acid because it contains the triglyceride esters of fatty acids. Now water was like 7, so it's neutral. And soy sauce turned like 4, between 3 and 4, so we know that soy sauce is acidic. Acidic, basic, acidic, neutral, acidic. So a lot of the stuff around us is acidic right now. So let me know in the comments that what should I try next time. With that said, peace out.